What's happening, everybody? Welcome back. This is Forgo. And today, I want to talk about the Alexandrite event and talk about some things that you guys need to know about this event and what I think Netmarble really needs to improve and also something else that needs to change immediately in this game because it is hurting players tremendously as far as getting their EX memory. Now, here's the thing about this, guys. You know, I've already talked about how you need 9,000 points to get this EX memory, right? But you still need to get these shards in order to change the memory to the respective color that you're looking for for your EX character. And the way that this works, and I didn't have this information before, so I couldn't relay it to you guys, but now I do. You need a hundred of these shards, guys, which means that you're going to need these 20, you're going to need these 30, and you're going to need these 50. That's a hundred shards in total in order to change that EX memory, which means you need to go to 16,000 points in order to do this. Now, for the players that are able to get the EX generic memory, and it's a color for, you know, and it's a respective color for what they actually need, this this won't be a big deal. But for a lot of players out there, considering there's five different colors, this is a big deal, right? They're trying to get to that 16,000 points so that way they can actually change the color to what they actually want for the character they're trying to level up. And 16,000 points is actually very difficult, but right now it's even more difficult than what it was before. And I'm going to show you guys what I'm talking about. But the first thing I want to do though is remind you that, you know, we did get this ticket today, right? And guys, the, all these tickets that we got so far in this week are going to expire after today. So make sure that you do use these tickets, gather as many points as possible in that Alexandrite event, right? We're going to go ahead and collect this thing and I'm going to show you guys what I'm talking about as far as the Alexandrite event is concerned. So in this event, guys, you know, I talked about how, you know, you need to have 28.5 billion every single day in order to get that 9,000 points to get that EX generic memory. Well, the thing is, guys, if you're trying to get to that 16,000 points and you're trying to get those shards, it takes 100 shards and it takes five, Ella, uh, five fest memories of the respective color you're trying to change. So say you want to change a green EX generic memory to a purple. Well, you would actually need five fest memories of the respective color you're trying to change to. So if I'm trying to change to a purple, I need five fest memories that are purple colors, right? And that's not a big deal. We get a lot of those memories through the United Banner. That's not a big problem. But the 100 shards, you need to get to 16,000 points. You need 100 shards plus five actual fest memories that you're trying to change the color to in order to change the extra generic memory to the color that you're actually trying to get, right? Well, 16,000 points is no small feat. You know, needing 28.5 billion a day just to get to 9,000 points is actually pretty damn difficult, but to get to 16,000 points, guys, you actually need to score 1,700 billion a week. And 1,700 billion a week averages out to about 243 billion a day. Now, I don't know about you guys, but on my free-to-play account, that is impossible. There is no way, and my free-to-play account is an account that is over a year old. Over a year old, my friends, right? Now, let me know down in the comments if you guys have a free-to-play account that's over a year old, and you're having a lot of problems, you know, trying to reach, you know, $242 billion. Now, this is my main account, and so obviously I'm going to be able to get, you know, everything that I need to change over the memory, but this is an account that can score... 350 billion in one run. Now I'm going to show you guys where the problem really is. Well, actually a few little problems and what they need to do to actually address it. So the first thing is guys, I'm going to grab my controller here. In fact, I don't even think I have my controller map. Let me make sure that it is on. All right. Let me make sure this thing's on. Okay. It was on. All right. Good, good, good. All right, my bad. So let's come back in here and let me show you guys what's going on, right? So I'm going to bring in my characters here. Uh, I mean, it really doesn't matter, to be honest. I'm really just kind of showing you guys what's going on, right? But watch this. All right, I want you to pay attention to what's going on. Now, I have a pretty powerful computer, and this is a PC client. And by the way, the same problem I'm about to show you is happening on our phones as well, at least on my Samsung S22 Ultra, which is over a $1,000 phone. Right? So if I'm having problems, I know a lot of you guys are having problems. Now watch what we're looking at here. Okay? Okay? Look at the lag, my friends. Look at the lag. Okay? And this lag just gets worse and worse and worse. And initially, I thought that maybe, you know, this was happening because of, you know, Kula's concentrate. But it is not. No matter what team I put in here, I am having the same problem. Look at this lag. Right? And what happens when you have lag? you lose frames. And what happens when you lose frames? You lose damage, guys. You lose a, look at this. I mean, you lose a tremendous amount of damage, right? 
just abysmal, right? And there's a lot of players that are, you know, playing this thing here, and they do not have these level up characters. They may, they might be on the brink of getting that 28.5 billion just to get the EX generic, right? not counting getting those shards. Right? This is an issue that needs to be fixed because in every other game mode in the game, no matter what I play, whether it's Tower Trials, whether it's Guild Raid, Colossal Boss Dungeon, it doesn't matter. I don't have any of these lag problems on the PC client. I only have it in this damn game mode right here. A game mode where you need a ridiculous amount of points in order to get the maximum rewards from that carnival. And this needs to be fixed. So what can they do? Well, one, they could just fix the problem, right? But say they're having problems. Say they're, you know, for whatever reason, they can't fix the problem. Well, there's another thing they could do. They could give us more tickets. They could give us more tickets. Or they could do like what I mentioned in a video a, a while back is the tickets wouldn't have an expir expiration date. You could just use the tickets for whatever specter color you have. That way, you know, your strongest colored characters can be available in here and get more points. They could do that, right? So extra tickets or making these tickets not have an expi expiration date. Or here's another little simple solution they could do. If they can't fix the, the Alexandrite event, they could just lower the amount of points that we need to get all these things, right? I mean, think about it, guys. Those players out there, right? I mean, on this account, on my main account, guys, I went from, you know, going to hitting 350 billion to now it's like 180 billion. And that's still a lot of points. But think about those players out there that are only scoring, you know, maybe 30 billion in the Alexandrite event. And now because of that lag, they might be only getting, you know, 15 billion, 10 billion, 12 billion. They're not going to be able to get this EX generic memory. Right? This needs to be a successful event, guys. It needs to be a successful event because Copus right now is in a place where, you know, people are kind of, eh, you know, they're kind of like, they're, they're feeling this kind of way. I mean, some people are just kind of out, right? And then some people, you know, they did come back because they did bring in EX generic memories. But this needs to be a successful event to keep those players wanting to play. I mean, Netmarble, you know, this is a business. You're trying to make money. If you want players to keep coming and keep playing the game, you need to address this issue. You need to fix that lag issue or you need to be lowering these points. Honestly, this is really ridiculous that you need this amount of points, guys. Like, on my free-to-play account, I'm not going to get all this. I'm not going to get these shards. I'm not going to be able to take this generic memory to the color that I want. And, you know, and initially, guys, you know, when I start talking about all this, I just talk about the extra generic memory, right? Because that essentially, that is what most people want. But let's be honest, right? Let's be honest. People really would like to have that thousand rubies, but more than that, they really would like to be able to get them shards so they can actually get an EX generic memory for the respective color that they want. You know, if they get a red, right, and they want to level up a green character, like say if like Rugal is their favorite, well, they're going to want these damn shards. And this is the only place to get these shards from, right? They're making this a limited thing. We need to be able to acquire these things, right? I mean, if, 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 if an over a year old account is having problems, guys, with A7 characters, even color characters with their respective colors, like Leona and Iori, my Leona and Iori are leveled up on my account. I do have a A7 Devil Gen, right? And I'm, I'm, I, you know, I score maybe, you know, max is like 70 billion. But now because of this lag, it's dropped down to like, you know, 35, 40 billion. That is a huge, huge loss. And so for a lot of you players, you know, like I said earlier, that are only getting maybe 30 billion, like you were just on the brink of getting this CX generic memory, this lag is going to screw you. So Netmarble needs to find a way to address it, you know, whether they fix the lag, whether they, you know, lower the amount of points that we actually need to get the maximum rewards out here, or, you know, whether they want to extend the banner, they could do that as well. They can make the tickets where they don't have a time restriction on them, right? I mean, there's all kinds of little things that they could do to fix this problem, right? I mean, because this is happening on my phone, not just PC client guys. It's happening on my S22 Ultra. This is a thousand dollar phone. Not everybody's got one of these damn things. And if it's happening on this, I can only imagine what's happening on other devices. I'm not really sure about iOS, if the same problem is happening on that or not. Let me know down in the comments below. But Netmarble, you seriously need to fix this ASAP, man. This needs to be fixed and needs to be addressed super fast. So hopefully by making this video, they will see this because we do know that they do watch these videos. Uh, hopefully they will fix this problems guys so everybody can get this EX generic memory at least at a minimum but I really would prefer if they would make it to where you know more players would be able to get all these shards because again guys on my free-to-play account that's over a year old with really developed characters 
I'm not going to get this. There's no way I'm going to get these shards with the amount of points that I'm able to score, especially due to the lag. And if I'm having those problems, I know a lot of other players are going to be having those problems as well. And, you know, you know, I don't expect, you know, players that's only been playing for one week or one month to be able to get all these rewards. I don't expect that at all. But players that's been playing this game for six months or more, you know, I would say should be getting all these rewards. I mean, if they've been playing this game for six months or more, I think they should definitely be getting these rewards, right? I've been playing my free-to-play account over a year, and I'm still not going to get all these rewards, right? Which is really a bunch of crap. That needs to change. They need to find a way to change some things, to address some of these things, so that way we can all get these rewards. So again, hopefully they will address these issues. Hopefully they will fix these lag issues or just make some other changes to where, you know, it'll be a little bit easier to be able to acquire enough points to be able to get the maximum rewards out of the Team Relay reward page. And also, let me know what kind of device you guys are playing on. And I do stream on Twitch at 9 p.m. to plus 7 time. The link is in the description below. And I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching. Y'all take care and have a good one. See everybody. Take care.